Hey guys, welcome back. Today, among other things, I'm off to the thrift store. Why? Well, you'll find out if I can find what I'm looking for. If not, well, I'll have to vlog about something else, but see you guys later. Hey guys. So, out of the thrift store, I was able to find three pieces toward costumes. One of them's not Star Wars, so I won't bring it up what it is, but it's a costume that I really want to put together eventually. Um... The others, um, I was able to get another pair of Jedi pants, which is, which I need badly so I can wear my other pants to church. And I also found a pair of pants that will probably work for Bespin Luke with some modifications. So, yeah. as soon as I get home, I will show you my purchases and talk about how I'm going to modify them for my costumes. Okay, so I'm back from the thrift store and I would like to show you the costume pieces I managed to pick up today. So, if you've been watching my channel for any length of time at all, you'll know that I have a fully approved Jedi costume. And uh, the pants that I had been using for several years are a complete toast. I wore my nice church pants uh, to the convention, so I decided, okay, I need a replacement pair. So, here they are. Classic khaki slacks and uh yeah no back pockets just a few front pockets which will be you know covered up so yeah these are now my new dress pants and the other pants that i was using are my new jedi pants so the only other thing i need to do now to update my basic jedi costume is get some new boots and those I'll probably find online sometime in the next couple of months. I'm not in any hurry. And the other thing I bought was a pair of cargo pants. Now, I'm not even sure if these things are going to fit. I may have to lose a couple more <laughs> pounds because this is a... Uh, uh -huh. They look uh, like they'll probably fit, but these are cargo pants. And there are a couple of modifications that need to be made before I can, you know use them but these are to be oh cool pockets in the back that i can take off and move excellent um these are going to be the pants that i'm going to use for my bespin luke now these are not like a perfect color but since i am constructing my bespin luke 100 percent from thrift store finds that i modify this is the best I could do. So, and I haven't even finished modifying the shirt yet. I can't do that without a sewing machine or some heavy duty, like iron on stitching stuff. So, let me change into these and you can see what they look like all together. I'll take the tag off first. Uh, okay, so it's definitely nowhere near perfect. I need to finish the fasteners on the jacket, which at this point are just Velcro. I need to cover up the buttonholes and put little, like, little flaps in there. And I need to modify the collar, straighten it out so it's more of a mandarin collar and not just a fold-over collar. And the pants, <laughs> I wasn't counting on this. They're actually lowriders. Uh, Luke's pants are supposed to be high-waisted, so I'm hoping that with the right kind of modifications, I can actually extend the waistband another... Of course, the phone's ringing extend the waistband another like two inches and another thing I need to do is take off the belt loops and the buttons and all this extra stitching right here after I do that I think they will be at least uh, I may if I can I may have to take off these pockets too I don't know if it's possible at this point, but yeah. And these are a little bit tight, but I am in the process of losing a few pounds. So hopefully by the time that's done, they will fit better. But, you know, they're not uncomfortable. And I am wearing lots of layers since it's winter time. So, yeah, and the, oh, the back pockets need to come off. So, yeah, those are the modifications I need to do on the shirt and the pants. And the belt, I can't seem to find right now, but I do have a belt that I need to take the buckle off and put a different buckle on. And I also need to grab several old belts and an old purse so I can make the holster. 
and of course find the legacy lightsaber on a blonde wig so uh there's quite a bit that needs to be done for bespin luke but if at all possible if i can do it cheaply and quickly oh yeah and of course i need to make some boots i'm planning on grabbing a pair of canvas sneakers and modifying it with the duck cloth that i have and then dyeing them like pearl gray so there we go that is all for my thrift store cosplay update i um if you enjoyed this video and want me to keep this up go ahead and post a comment uh i don't have a question of the day i will bring that to you for my episode 9 vlog which is coming up very soon but i will see everybody later and until then god bless and may the force be with you bye